can't decide Fashion week was more your thing than mine I can't even lie I'd rather stay inside I can't do so than I can't be Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel I'm Lisa, I create content Subscribe for the vibes Make sure you're part of the fam. If you're not new here, then hey guys, welcome back. You guys know how we be and how we do. Today we have a hair install video. I'm not gonna lie, I'm thoroughly enjoying doing these videos because I change my hair a lot, so it just makes sense for me to at least film it and show you guys. Um, so today I'm installing this 22 inch water wave unit. This is actually, it's a glueless five by five. I did put glue on it, yeah, but I only did one layer. Um, but yeah, it's a 5x5 five five close unit from Asteria Hair. So yeah, just, I don't want to ramble on too long, but just sit back, enjoy, and watch me install this hair start to finish. Right, so guys, this is the hair just after bleaching the closure bit. I didn't um, completely like wash this wig, I just did the closure bit. But yeah, so Asteria Hair sent me all of these goodies in the packaging as well. The wig caps, the melt band, the edge brush and of course the little bag to put the wig in and to be honest i didn't really have to do much to this hair at all you're just seeing me here hot comb the roots just a little bit because i wanted it to lay quite flat on my head sometimes curly hair can be a bit bulky so i just went ahead and like just hot comb the front here like you guys see me do and that's literally all i did i did that put some mousse on it and plucked it a little bit so it's super self-explanatory, so I'm going to be back once I'm installing it. see here i'm just adjusting it just to make sure it fits properly there are two clips on the side as well so you could probably wear this glueless and then just clip in the clips and literally you're good to go um i didn't really have to put glue on this but i just wanted to do one layer just because you know i want it to be stuck down and this is the perfect hair for holiday um yeah i'm definitely gonna be wearing this on my holiday but yeah so just one layer of glue like this I did one or two. Did I do one or two? No, just one. And yeah, I just blow dried it. Waited for it to get not completely dry, but like just before it's dry. It's clear glue anyway. So I really like working with this glue. And then I just sprayed a tiny bit of the ebbing spray. Um, you guys can go ahead and check out all of my wig essentials in the description box. Everything I use basically to get a flawless install every single time. And yeah, as soon as I blow dried it, I just placed it down, pressed it into place, and put the melt band on. So once the melt band was on, I just went in with like a black liner pen and I just filled in the areas where it wasn't over bleached but i just wanted a clean part and then went in with some concealer and really made sure that part was parting <laughs> and yeah so i left the melt band on for about 10 minutes and guys this melt like hold on hold on, hold on. like are you guys seeing this like are you guys seeing this because i'm seeing it and this is what I keep saying about like this wig is just so easy to work with because even if it was glueless, it would still look so good. But imagine this is just with one layer of glue and a bit of ebbing spray. So next I went in with this eyebrow razor, this facial razor. You guys know the razor I'm talking about. You guys can see the razor. And yeah, I just cut the lace on this wig. I do not like cutting it with like scissors straight across because 
it just makes the wig look too wiggy when it comes to the lace you want that jagged edge kind of vibe so it blends better into your skin and once i did that i sprayed a tiny bit of ebbing on the edges and i used a face powder just to help it blend in a little bit more and then i did baby hairs so for the baby hairs right i didn't use any like gel or anything or edge control all i did was um i took out the hair like this and then i just trimmed them and then i used the Kerry hair hair mousse to mold them after i used a little pencil straightener and that was it i like using um mousse because it gives that fluffy look if you don't want that proper like stuck down edges look and you want that fluffy look then definitely use mousse because when it dries down it gives the edges that fluffy vibe you, you guys know the vibe i'm talking about and i wanted that vibe because this hair's curly as well and yeah that was literally it this video is so self-explanatory this wig took me like 15 minutes to install and yeah i'm just gonna let you guys enjoy watching the rest of me installing the video and yeah thank you hysteria hair for sending me this wig i absolutely love it thank you so 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 much for watching do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll see you guys in my very next video bye